night. It's just a few minutes after five. I've been in the ground blind back, well, you can't see it back there in this creek bottom for an hour and one minute. And uh, four deer came in, shot a big doe, shot her really good. I, sh I think she fell. I think I saw her go down out there. So uh, first one of the year, I'm gonna go find her when, like I say, when, when the Hoyt whispers in your ear, it's too late. <laughs> There's my arrow. Yeah, good blood. Oh, come back. Yeah. When the Hoyt whispers, <laughs> something's in trouble. Yeah, I believe I got her now. Got out of the bottom just a little bit and uh, got into this edge of this pine thicket. Went about 60 yards. Yeah, you can see where the arrow went in. You know, she was quartering to me, so I had to shoot forward uh, so that when it went past through her chest, it would pass through uh, her, you know, heart and lungs and stuff before it went out uh, too far back on the other side. So uh, for, you know, 23 yards, it was top pin, but good shot. Man, that's hard work getting a deer out of the woods by yourself. Yeah, anyway, North Louisiana's a full-grown doe. Had to drag her across two creeks and get her here to the truck. It's a lot of work, but I got it loaded up, tagged, and on the way to the processor before dark. So, <laughs> good job for the fat boy. <laughs>